Now, what era? What like what era was the height of the Curie thing? I want to say late eighties. Huh. Late eighties into the early nineties, somewhere in there. Hey, they say that I'm talking a whole lot of trash. I'm sitting there thinking like, who knew? I know that you've seen us on rappers react. They're talking about us on YouTube. Hollywood six, it look like I do magic. Maybe he's practicing voodoo. I'm hearing you're getting a lot of attention. Well, I'm here to say that we do to deliver the rubbish. I'm What's going on, everybody? We're back with another segment of Rappers React. Smoke dog. All right. I have trivia for What's you. What's it? Who was the only person, or I'm sorry, who was the only prison inmate to admit that he is guilty in the movie, your favorite movie, The Shawshank Redemption? Shawshank Redemption, that was, that was red, wasn't it? Correct, yeah. my friend. All right, how about this? Uh, Andorra is part of which continent? Andorra. Hmm. I know of Andorra, but I can't remember where it's at. Um, is it Asia? Nope. Is it Africa? Nope. It's not Europe. It's is it Europe? Yes, sir. Scheme. Oh, wow. Okay. All right. Uh, this is crazy right here. Uh, what group of workers staged the first organized labor strike in history? This is crazy. What group of workers? Um, the Ste first labor strike in history. Was it the steel workers? The way, auto workers? Way back. Oh, way back. Oh, so we're talking like ancient Greece or something? Probably before that, I think. Oh, Jesus. Uh, what was, was that a clue? The Egyptian pyramid builders. Oh, really? They said, I'm tired of moving these damn blocks, man. These things <laughs> Do we even know who they were, though? That's, again... Because some people say they were slave labor. You know, some people... I don't know. Everybody's got their own no, theories. Nobody knows how the pyramids are yeah. built. If you guys got your theories... On how the pyramids are built, let us know down in the comments. Mm -hmm. Let's do some quick. Would you rather trash talkers? Feel free to play with us down along down in the comment section. Smoke Dog, what's your dream car? My dream car is a '69 Dodge Charger 446 pack. See, I can't do all the numbers. I just know that uh, my my uh, uncle had a '87 T top Cutlass. Mm -hmm. That shit was so clean, bro. Yeah. And it was like wine beer or. Burgundy, if y'all don't know why I'm here, is that Grand National? Oh, too. That shit was clean, man. Ooh. Trash talkers, y'all let us know what's your dream car down in the comment section. All right, let's see if I can get you guess the title of this one here. Uh, hey, I just took a picture, Mult, uh, plural pictures. All right, uh, one of the most common words in English language starts with an O of pictures of you. You got it, my friend. And guys, before we get started, please do us a big, big favor. Y'all, please hit that thumbs up button. Guys, please subscribe to the channel. Have a God. sake, leave us a comment and tell us what to react to next. That's how we get the ideas for these videos. Comes directly from you. Right down in the comment section. And today, the cure. The cure. The cure. Now you need a cure for that. I need a cure for that. There, yeah. we could see we could make this whole just the title of the name of this band an entire podcast if we wanted to, <laughs> but we're not gonna do yeah. that. But now listen, the band. Yeah, you. I think we both kind of have a love hate relationship with this band. <laughs> yeah. Would you like to tell your Nate story again? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I've told it several times on here, but for those that don't know, uh, I used to get a ride to school before I started driving my own car. I'd get a ride to school with this dude that I hung out with at school. And one day he pulled up, you know, we're usually listening to, to Master P was huge at that time. Master P, Cypress Hill, you know, whatever we were listening to. He pulls up one day and I get in the car and there's just these xylophones playing. Like, ding, 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 ding. Watch it be this song. <laughs> it might be. And I'm riding like, I, I give it a good three or four minutes before I'm like, what the hell are we listening to? <laughs> <laughs> He's like, what? I can't listen to The Cure. So that's Smokey's The Cure story. Mine is, and Trash Talkers, correct me if I'm wrong, but there's a song that three, I think 311 covered it. I will always Yeah, love we talked it. about that on the live stream. Yeah, and, but I think The Cure did it first. You know? Yeah, I thought we had covered that song, but apparently not. We haven't done The Cure. I yeah. mean, so, like, so Smokey's told his story, mm -hmm. you know, his cure. I've told my story many times. We both told our stories on the show, but it's like, 
we both ha- we have a uh what's the word i'm looking for we have a we know something of the cure mm-hmm. because you being like bro what the hell are we listen to <laughs> yeah. and to me hearing like oh I yeah. will, and it's like okay that's actually they did it first i can't remember who did it first y'all let us know i'm sure y'all have before. yeah they, they they said it yeah. many times was it, it the was, cure first yes, right yes. i thought so all right yeah they were around before 311 100 percent. which we need to do some more 311 we do too. it's been a while now what era what like what era was the height of the cure you think i want to say late 80s Huh. Late eighties into the early nineties, somewhere in there. To me, it's kind of hard. Like I don't even know what genre to put them in. I don't know. It's kind of. It's kind of early industrial, right? Or you just I think about them damn xylophones. <laughs> I know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I, I really don't know. I haven't explored enough of their music to know like what their normal sound is. But for some reason, I feel like it's almost new wave-ish, but with a little bit of a hardcore edge to it. Trash Talkers, y'all let us know. What genre would you put the cure in? Now, pictures of you with us not knowing almost nothing about them, mm-hmm. other than they being the originators of I Will Always Love You and mm-hmm. you telling Nate, what the hell is we listening to? Yeah. <laughs> what you got with pictures of you? Uh, it's probably <clears throat> another love story, right? Smoked up! What up? Let's get into it. Ah, let's do it. We got a music video. Come on. alternative vibe, right? I want to hear the xylophones. I've been looking so long at these pictures of Looking at him, you think emo. Living so long with my pictures of you that I almost believe that the pictures are all I can do. Where are they with snow and palm trees? <laughs> Where are y'all?
almost. This was filmed in Andorra. <laughs> it must be. <laughs> All right, let's get the hell out of here. It's freezing. <laughs> yeah. Huh. Oh, now we have a snow little funny. That's definitely white makeup, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I said, y'all need to go into the sun a little bit more, bro. Yeah, that um, that video is quite a. What's the word I'm looking for? It's, it's two opposites. It shouldn't be together. Listen, it's an oxymoron. I've I've heard of a uh, um uh, uh paradise in, or a paradise in the desert. You know <laughs> yeah. what I mean? I've heard of that. I mean, it looked like they were at an oasis in the desert, but oh, oasis in the Arctic. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's what it looked like. Yeah. Is that the opposite of an oasis, oasis in the desert? desert is the <laughs> it's the Arctic, and there's one little spot that's yeah, not frozen. Just <laughs> palm, trees. palm trees and. <laughs> coconuts and all kind of stuff <laughs> yeah man you got a bunch of things from this dude you got like i, I mentioned the goth they have a goth look yeah and you yeah. mentioned new age earlier you new know wave. new wave sorry yeah. it has a new wave uh feel to this song yeah and again we don't we don't know much about it to like classify them as one because they could have multiple genres right or, yeah yeah definitely i mean most bands do most bands do you know there's always that one that you're gonna get classified whatever you break onto the scene with your radio hit, whatever yeah. that is. That's who people think you are. But most bands venture out for sure. I wonder if this is a radio hit. It has to be, right? I and mean, they made a video for it, so Bro, I'm guessing I, they pushed it as a single. It, man, I'm telling you, dude, this Mandela effect. You don't remember doing a video like this, like watching a video where it was like Arctic and they had. I remember. I feel hmm. like I remember what It may not. I'm. I'm pretty sure it's not the cure because we checked and we didn't do it yeah. but I remember watching a video where they were in the Arctic and they had like palm trees in the Arctic and they were filming and throwing snowballs and everything huh. I could e either I've seen this video before but I really mm -hmm. watching this video really had me thinking like god dang I've seen this somewhere <laughs> you had some deja vu yeah vuja yeah. day yeah vuja day or whatever you want to call it mm -hmm. but now preve vu yes that's what it's called that's right so as far as pictures of you, I'm curious uh, as what you got because I think this is kind of on the nose, right? Yeah, yeah, I think so. I think he just uh, is remembering his probably his first love. Yeah, and, uh, and he's like just thinking about how you know, you know the the rush of hormones you get and like uh, that feeling you get the first time you fall in love. Yeah, especially if it's. Not like, you know, people like, oh, yeah, I fell in love with this girl in the third grade. No. no like, the girl that you actually was able to spend time with yeah, like outside high, like school. late high school or something. Yeah, you're going over to her house or she's coming to your house. And you, mama's that like, feeling. that's fine, just leave the door open. Leave <laughs> yeah. the door open, you know? Just <laughs> yeah. leave the door open. But that feeling right there, you'll remember that for the rest of your life. Yes. And dude, you bring up them pictures and you're like, oh, Damn, that was some good days. Like. Yes. Dude, it's crazy. I remember, like, bringing back... You know, a little personal history here, but you said, you know, talking about uh, your high school love, mm -hmm. like my first true love. Now, I went, yeah, I guess someone that I actually said, all right, I love you, it was in high school. Mm -hmm. But I remember the first conversation I had with her, and I, you know, like you're, you're afraid that this was before texting, this was mm -hmm. before you could text and do all that. But like, she gave you, gave me my, gave, or she gave me your number. Mm -hmm. So I'm like, God damn, what do I say? What do I say? Dude, yeah. I would write, I would write <laughs> questions down, like how I trivia you. I'd be like, How so, are you today? Yeah, or like, what's your favorite color? What kind of food do you like? And I'm like, hey, what's going on, girl? Oh, nothing. So, uh, what's your favorite color? And I mean, hey, I, it, it did what it did, yeah, but... Make sure you didn't freeze up. Yeah, man, I, I tried to... That, that's something I think me and you both have, is like, we mm -hmm. were conversationalists, so we try to keep the conversation yeah. going. Yeah, absolutely. And, yeah. But as far as what you're saying about the song, I think you're 100% right. I think it's about either an old love or someone that either passed on. Could be that, too, where it's like, look, I held you. You know, I held that heart, or that stone-cold heart that you had. And now that you left, you know, all I have left is just... The pictures, yeah. Could be. Yeah, and it makes you all sentimental when you look at them. Yeah. You're like, why in the hell did we break up in the first place? Well, shit. Sure. Then you got some pictures, some pictures of some of your ex girlfriends. You're like, what? How the hell did I even date you? <laughs> <laughs> hey, you pull out one. You're like, who the hell is that? What? Yeah, like I was with her. I was with that. <laughs> Man, I'm sure we've all had those stories. Smokey's got his. I'm sure mm -hmm. I've got mine. I'm sure many trash talkers out, out there has got that as well. Guys, let us know what your interpretation is of pictures of you by the Cure down in the comment section. Also, let us know what's next by the Cure as well down in the comment section. And with that being said, 
My name is Beringer Hollywood Six. Bye. I am Larry Smokey Ramirez Kellen. And we are over and out. Deuces. Yeah, boy. I want to thank you guys for spending a little bit of time with us today. If you want to see the last video we did, just click right over here. Or if you want to see another artist that we covered, just click right over here. If you guys want to support the channel, please consider joining our Patreon right over here. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you on the next one. Deuces.